If you overlook the fact that they really are potentially the same person, it could be the same terrorist, it could be somebody you're not supposed to do business with if you're in a compliance situation, it could be the same customer. Uh, you hear stories of um, insurance companies uh, treating a customer in a bad way and then it ends up being the son of their biggest customer and they end up losing their the account. So there's all these implications to a business when these things that look like small uh, Small changes affect um, uh, the small changes in data how they impact the business. So, what does it mean when the data isn't exactly perfect? Well, the, the kind of things we take for granted, like finding records. How many people here have had trouble finding a contact in Outlook, say? How frustrating is that? It's 2008, and if you get one letter off when you're trying to find somebody in Outlook, it doesn't find it. Is that stupid? I mean, it's just, to me, it just doesn't make any sense. No offense to Salesforce, we're a long-time customer, but I can't tell you how irritating it is that if I don't get the company name exactly right, I'm out of luck. And I think that's going to change. We are on the cusp of this change happening. Uh, as the data, as we try to get more and more out of the data, we're going to have to deal with these discrepancies, whether we like it or not. So all of the, all of the um, components that are built on top of this data that's collected, that's of value to an organization, ends up being at risk, whether it's uh, a BI application, a data integration application, whatever it is that the, that the organization is trying to leverage, uh, putting together an Amazon web page, uh, building a system on top of uh, Salesforce.com or Force.com, uh, whatever it might be, you're, you're now at risk because all the good work you're doing to collect information, you're not taking the next step, right? And the next step is making sure that you can deal with the data despite the inherent imperfections.